Spider and Architect Mina, aka, yeah. <laughs> depending on where you find me, I am congested and sick, so I apologize, guys, all automatically for any unpleasant sounds you might hear regarding that, so bear with me on that. Um, but we have our stadium here, and, uh, and we are already have our first visitors starting to enter. Um, we got about two months before our next match uh, of game months that is so uh, we'll keep an eye on that now while that's going I mean and you can see it's already um, getting a lot of people coming in look at that look at the people just flow on in from that metro station um, so while we're doing that if, if you can leave me a comment I mean uh, we got some cars just populated here, but there's so many cars that are just not there. I wonder if there's a good way to populate uh, these parking lots more realistically. I know there's got to be without necessarily like plopping cars in myself. So uh, if you can give me an idea of how to do that, uh, I'd really appreciate that. Um, now that being said, uh, I wonder if we want to kind of make a park out of this area here. Um, I kind of don't want to. But uh, I think we do need to do something with it. And I don't want to necessarily just build a bunch of buildings here. I think that doesn't make sense. So what are we going to do with it, guys? I don't know. Let me think about it. Let, why don't you all uh, give me suggestions in the comments as well, if you have them. And we'll see what we'll do. But um, let's take a look here. What do we got? I think we're going to get our 750 easy. On this on this uh, first match, one to bet now. Uh, you have different uh, policies here that you can uh, bring. So come one, come all makes all the uh, transportation to the stadium free on match day, which really de decreases your income. And I think that I'm not going to need. I think uh, my my Sims will come on their own volition now. We can hire security staff. Uh, it'll cost a little bit more, but it'll keep the crime rate lower. I think I'm gonna go ahead and do that. And subsidized youth, I absolutely will do that. Um, that just increases the, the pool from which the team has to uh, bring new talent in as time goes on, which we, we definitely wanna do that. And it's also good for the kiddies. Um, now, i tell you what I'll do. I, I know what I'm going to do with the stuff in this area. We're going to put... So it is going to be park area, but it's not going to be like just pure park. We're going to stick in a soccer field. Don't I have a soccer field somewhere around here? That's a track and field. I don't necessarily want to do that. I want, to, I want... Isn't there a soccer field somewhere around here? I know what we'll do. We'll use our handy dandy find it. Small soccer stadium. That is gorgeous and perfect, and I will take it. Mm, this is almost kind of big. Maybe we'll stick it over here. Mm, I can't really attach to that. Hmm. Maybe we can stick it in right there. We'll see about that. How does that look? Oh boy, does that look fantastic or what? Yeah, I like that. And so, well, then we'll go ahead and put some pathways here. I'll just do a straight normal pathway here, nothing fancy. Let's uh, move this a little bit, see if we can't, uh... there we go. Really like the way that looks. Okay. 
Oh my goodness. Yeah, that looks fantastic. I mean, it makes a lot of sense you'd have like a little practice uh, stadium next to the main one. Um, probably have the kids uh, before the game. They'd come and play over here. Let's see how we're doing here. Yeah, we're, we're so close. We're not even so close to match day yet. We still got a couple days left. And we're almost fully, uh, fully sold out. We're almost sold out. That's the word. There we go. So I'm looking forward to this. This match, we're going to kick the ever-loving you-know-what out of our, our opponents here. Uh, when they show up, the poor guys. <laughs> you know, you think you think that this uh, parking lot would be just a little bit more, you know, Filled up, but alas, not. Yeah, I got those nice bigger buses here. That's what I put. I put in a regular bus station here now. Fortunately, we also get like a, a random school bus here and stuff like that. But um, there's a way to control that, and um, I haven't figured that out quite yet. So I'm gonna have to work on that. But let's see here. Mash day's coming up. Yeah, it's gonna be a little bit of a while more. Let's see, what else can we do with this area? Um, to really kind of spiff it up. Um, I don't know. Put like a little market in here. Building already exists. Okay. Maybe put some sort of monument in here. It's kind of a funny looking monument. Not sure I want that. I don't like that. What else we got? Sparkly Unicorn Park. some sense to me that we add it in over here as well. I'm going to move this one back to here. Move that over just a wee bit. All nice and connected. Well, there we go. You know what I probably want to do? I probably want to put. Oh, and I think the soccer match has started. Um, let's go take a look at that. I want right before I'll go ahead and put a crosswalk right there. That's good. Yeah. So look at that. We got. Oh, not quite. We only have seven hundred twenty-three out of seven hundred and fifty. But I have a feeling that's still going to be enough. You always have somebody die at one of these games. You're always going to have a death in one of these games, it seems like. Uh, it's actually going down. Maybe we're not playing too, the, too well right now. Let's see here. Well, hopefully that match goes well. Yeah, I like that little plaza, Sparkly Unicorn Park thing going on there. 
little playground, place for the kitties to play. Uh, kind of connects it pedestrian wise a lot better too. So, the uh, next thing I, uh, I might want to do is I'm gonna. Uh, I'm gonna click on a bunch of buttons so I find what I'm looking for. There we go. So maybe put something like this right here. I don't know. Maybe I want to move it on uh, down this way. So I'm not really deleting too much. There we go. Make that little connection there. That way people don't have to walk all the way around. They can just go straight across. Like that. And man, I, I'm, I'm kind of digging the area. It's, it's Obviously it's low density here as far as the height, but you got that stadium and that looks fantastic. And we got, oh, we're back up to 723. Match is still going on. And we'll see how that goes. All right. Lots of people coming and going as well. I think just to get to here. If nothing else, a lot of these people are going to walk across just to go to that metro stop there. Some of the traffic over here. Yeah, we got some pretty heavy traffic going on here. There's only so much I can do about it. I've done everything. I got these elevators here, and it kind of made made it to where you can get across without having to do the crosswalk. So there's no pedestrian uh, stopping here. I don't know. I don't know what else I can do. Make sure that maybe we, we do something along these lines. Where we don't treat it as an intersection. So we just kind of push right on through. Some of it is you just got some turbulence from crossing the streams over here. And there's only so much you can do about that. some people. That's the buses over here. The buses look fine. Really be interesting once uh, it lets out, you know, having the, the tidal flow of everybody leaving the stadium. I really like the stadiums they, they did. I mean, I think they could have done it better. I, I wish, you know, I could have American football or maybe a baseball stadium, stuff like that. But, you know, in the end, you know, I, I think it really does add something to the to the game. And so, you know, sometimes you just got to take what you can get, right? I'm going to move this over just a, a, a tear. Because it was creating a little scene there I didn't like. But now it's doing it over here. So what I might do is I'll take this and I'll just, I'll fix that up. Fix that right on up. Just like that. We will move that over. And gorgeous. Okay. Uh oh. Is the game over? Game's over. Did we win? Did we win? We won! Nice. So, okay, so look. let's take a look, watch, watch all these people file out. Mass file out. It's really not too, too bad when you consider you just had 750 people piling on out. But, uh, so let's take a look. Okay, so we won $239,000. Is that right? Yeah, because we won 200 there, and then we got another 39,000 from ticket sales. Uh, so we get 200,000 just for winning, and then all that's from ticket sales. And our expenses are 9,500. So I'd say that's a win. And so uh, as long as you keep them winning, um, it's it really is uh, uh, a profitable prospect. If your team starts losing, uh, you need to start managing it a little bit um, because ultimately it's going to cost you money.
Um, now, if it costs you money and it's not really hurting you, you, you know, no big deal. But if you want it to make you money, you got to have to manage it. Let me put it that way. It seems like most people just went through this uh, uh, metro station there. Some people drove off, but not not too shabby when all things can are considered. Uh, let's take a look at our traffic situation here. You know, I think I'm going to cut the episode short here. I know it was just basically a little match day uh, stadium episode just to kind of show you how that works. Kind of spiff that area up a little bit. Um, I do think it's looking pretty good. Uh, we do need to do something for the other side of this train over here, though. Um, maybe put some good offices to continue from these offices over here. Um, really, we need more commercial, so we'll probably do commercial along there. And one of the things I was thinking about doing is um, I had done an episode, or not really an episode, I had done a little tutorial uh, where I sunk down the, this road over here, um, made it a, a sunken uh, highway there, and to where you could go just straight across. And I might try and do that again. So coming starting from right there, have it come sunken all the way down to about right here, and make this to where it's a little bit more seamless on how it crosses over I think that will really add something to the look of this whole area here and we're going to want to step down um, so I might need to do some you know, this can still be high density but for here I'm going to need to work on making it uh, medium density by hand I think so that it doesn't too out of place then you get to the all these suburbs over here and uh, you, know, you want it you know I kind of like how this this uh, is all just zoned but it just is naturally doing what I want it to do um, and, and over here you know obviously we did it manually and uh, I think that looks pretty good so that is it thanks guys for watching and I will talk to you later bye